Now let's see this example. Design a more mission that counts the occurrences of the sequence a b b in any input string over a comma b. So here input alphabet mainly contains two symbols. They are sigma is equal to a comma b. Here we have to find out how many times a b b is present in the given string. The number of occurrences of a b b in the given string. Right, the string is like this a b a. So in this here we don't have a b b sequence. So the output is zero. Let we have a sequence like this a b b. So one time a b b is present. Let we have a sequence like this a b b b a b b. So one time one time. So two times. So we have to perform some operation on the number of occurrences. So here the output alphabet mainly contains two symbols. So delta is equal to zero comma one. So zero means that sequence is not found. So one means that sequence is found one time. So simply we have to add these values. Okay. So that is about output alphabet. Now we have to construct the DFA. So more emission is nothing but constructing the DFA only. More emission or more emission is nothing but constructing the DFA only. Okay. So here the sequence contains three symbols A, B, B. So if the here uh, the size of a b b is 3 so here the dfa totally contains 3 plus 1 totally dfa contains four states so the states of the dfa are four so first one is q naught next one is q1 next state is q2 next state is q3 we know that uh, uh, in more emission we have only uh, starting state uh, we don't have any final state okay uh, next here uh, what is the sequence? A, B, B is the sequence. A, B, B is the sequence. If the uh, sequence is uh, A, B, B, then simply we have to display the output as 1. Whereas if the sequence is not A, B, B, then let us display that sequence as 0. So 0 means that sequence is not found. So 1 means that sequence is found. Now we have to make this as the DFA. What is DFA? Each state must uses the symbols present in the alphabet. Here the input alphabet mainly contains two symbols A and B. So in each state we have to use A and B. So on Q0 A is applied. Now we have to apply B. Here the sequence contains A, B, B. But before A, B, B we can have any number of Bs. So there is no problem. So on Q0 A is applied as well as B is applied. Now we have to apply A on Q1. A on Q1. Here what is the sequence? A, B, B is the sequence. So if, if we apply the self transition like this, so we can have A, B, B. So after A, we may have A, B, B sequence. So in those situations, this is helpful. Next, uh, uh, so on Q1, A is applied, B is applied. Uh, next on Q2, B is applied. Now we have to apply A. Now we have to apply A. Here what is the sequence? A, B, B is the sequence. So if we make a transition like this, if we make a transition like this uh, on A, A, B, B, A, B, B. So after A, A, we may have A, B, B, A, B, B. So in those situations, uh, it will be accepted. The sequence will be helpful. Next, we have to apply both A and B on Q3. Both A and B on Q3. So if we apply A here, so simply like the previous one, we can go from here to here. So A. After A, we can have B, B. So A, B, B sequence. And next here, we have to apply the B. So we can a make a transition like this. So after B, we can have A, B, B. After B, we can have A, B, B. So this is the more mission. So what is the difference between more mission here? Uh, the difference between more mission and melee mission is, in more mission, E state has uh, an output irrespective of any input. That output is same only. So here the output of the Q0 is 0, irrespective of uh, it may be either 0 or 1. Likewise, the output of Q1 is 0, irrespective of input A, irrespective of input is either A or B. Okay. So DFA means uh, we don't have any output here. DFA doesn't produce any output. Whereas more mission, melee mission means it produces some output. So this is the more mission. Now we have to check whether this is valid uh, 
uh, more mission or not. So for that, let us take an input string. Let the string is ABB. Let the string is ABB. So ABB here, what is the sequence here? ABB is the sequence. So ABB occurs one time. Now let's check whether we are getting that output or not. So first we always starts from the initial state that is Q0. Q0 on A, Q0 on A goes to Q1. What is Q1 output? 0. What is Q0 output? 0 only. Next, Q1 on B, Q1 on B goes to Q2. Q2 output is also 0. Next, Q2 on B, Q2 on B goes to Q3. What is Q3 output? 1. So here we have the sequence ABB. So that's why we got 1 as the output. So with this we can conclude that ABB occurred one time in the string. Now let us take one more string. Let the string is like this. ABB, B, ABB. ABB, BB, ABB. So ABB, this is one sequence. This is one sequence, this is one sequence. So after this sequence, we will get one as the output. After this sequence, we will get one as the output. So one plus one means two. So we can say that two times it appears. Now let's check whether it is correct or not. Q naught, output of Q naught is zero. Q naught on A means Q1. Q1 output is zero. Next, Q1 on B means Q2. Q2 output is zero. Q2 on B means Q3, Q3 output is 1. So here we have the sequence ABB. So that's why here we got 1 as the output. Next Q3 and B. Q3 and B means we'll go to Q0. Q0 output is 0. Next Q0 and B. Q0 and B means Q0, on, Q0 only. So 0 is the output. Q0 on A means Q1. Q1 output is 0. Next Q1 on B means Q2. Q2, what is Q2 output? Q2 output is 0. Next Q2 on B means, Q2 on B means Q3. Q3 output is 1. So here we have the sequence ABB. So that's why we got 1 as the output. So with this we can say that, uh, so ABB occurred twice in the input stream. Now let's see this example. Design a more mission that prints A. Whenever the sequence 0, 1 is encountered, encountered means occurred, in any input string. So here the sequence is 0, 1. So that means input alphabet contains zeros and 1s. Uh, whereas what is the output alphabet? It prints A. So we can have A and B. So if the sequence is 0, 1, then it prints A. If we don't have 0, 1 sequence, then it print 1, 0. Okay. I'm sorry. Then it print B. Let the sequence is 1, 0. So in this occasion, we will get B as the output. Whereas if we have 0, 1 sequence, then it will print A as the output. So first we have to construct the DFA and then we need to convert the DFA into more mission. And after that we have to check whether uh, uh, that mission is valid or not by taking some input string. Uh, here the uh, sequence contains 0, 1. So 0, 1 length is 2. So we require three states. So they are Q0 is the initial state. Next state is Q1. I'm sorry. Let us take... Uh, uh, somewhat bigger circles. Why? Because uh, more emission means uh, we have to represent output also in the corresponding state. So Q0 state, Q1 state, Q2 state. So more emission means we don't have any final state, but the initial state is Q0. Uh, uh, input is 0, 1. If the sequence is 0, 1, then we have to print A as the output. Otherwise, B is the output. So Q0 output is B, Q1 output is B, Q2 output is A. Now, uh, DFA means each state must uses all the symbols present in the alphabet. Here the alphabet has two symbols, but on Q0 we have applied only 0. So now we, we need to apply 1. Before this 0, 1, we can have any number of 1s. So there is no constraint on that. Next, on Q1, 1 is applied. Now we have to apply 0. If we apply 0 here, if we apply 0 here, then what will happen? This will become 0, 1. 0, 1 is nothing but sequence only. So we can apply a self-transition like this. So on Q1 also, 0 is applied as well as 1 is applied. Next on Q2, we have to apply 0 as well as 1. Now let us apply transitions on Q2. Uh, so we need to apply 0 transition as well as 1 transition. So if we make a transition like this, 
after 0, 0, 1. So, 0, 1. This is the transition. This is the sequence. So, let the transition is like this. So, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. Okay. So, 1, we will be at Q0 only. 0, we will move to the Q1. Uh, Q1 on 0 means we will be at Q1 only. Next again, uh, uh, 0 means we will be at uh, here only. 1 means we go to this state. So, after this, let me have 1 more 0, 1. So, 0 means we will go to the Q1. Again, we have 1. Uh, next here, uh, from Q2, uh, we can make a transition like this. Why? Because after 1, we can have 0, 1. After 1, we can have 0, 1. But here, after 0, after 0, we can have 1. After 0, we can have 1. So, the sequence will become 0, 1. But here, we have to apply 1. So, after 1, the sequence is 0, 1. Okay. So, this is the more emission. Now, let's check whether uh, this is correct or not by taking some input, st input string. Uh, let us take... Uh, uh, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. So, let me, uh, here initial state is Q0. So, we have to start from Q0 only. So, Q0 on 1 means, Q0 on 1 means Q0 only. Next, Q0 on 0 means Q1. Q1 on 1 means Q2. Q2 on 0 means Q1. Q1 on 0 means Q1, Q1 on 0 means Q1, Q1 on 1 means Q2. The output of Q2 is 1. The output of Q2 is 1, whereas the remaining states output is 0 only. Q0, Q0, Q1, Q1, Q1 output is 0 only. Here we have 0, 1 sequence. So that's why we got 1. Here also we have 0, 1 sequence. So that's why we got 1. So with this we can say that 1 plus 1 means 2. So 2 times 0, 1 sequence is present in the string. So in this way... Uh, we can solve this problem.